Welcome back, Mitch Dantone here. Today I'm going to go over how to wire a three-way switch step-by-step, step, break it down. It's very simple, you'll have it in no time. So first things first, I have 12-2 Romex for our incoming power. That's a black, hot, white neutral, and a bare ground. We have a 12-3 going switch to switch. Those are our travelers, black, red, white, neutral, and bare ground. So let's make sure power is off before we get started. Always make sure power is off before you work on anything. Power is off. We'll get started with our grounds. Always grounds first. Separate everything. We'll twist these grounds together. We can cut one of them off. We just need one to tie onto the switch. Make a little loop with your strippers right here. Now on the three-way switch, you're gonna have a common terminal. That black terminal is our common terminal. I'll get to that in a second. First, let's put our ground on. Always remember, we put the loop on anything we're doing on a switch receptacle to make the loop face the same direction that you're tightening. So you're actually tightening that loop as you tighten the terminal screw. All right, next, let's get our neutrals. These two neutrals will tie together like this and a wire nut. Now, our 12-2 Romex, the black, the hot from the 12-2 is going to be the common terminal. So we see the common terminal here. Nice and tight, give it a little pull test. Now, from our 12-3, we have our black and red traveler wires. Those are gonna go on the bronze screws. Doesn't matter which side you put it on, just make sure they go on the bronze terminals. That's all that matters. So our 12-3 black and red go on the brown on the bronze terminals. Our incoming power hot goes on the black common terminal. Moving over to this switch, we're gonna do the exact same thing. We're gonna tie our grounds together first. We only need one, so we'll cut one off. Make our loop. Nice and tight. Next, we're going to do our neutrals. Oops. 
wire nut together. Same process. Our travelers are going to go here on the bronze screws, black and red. Now, our 12-2 going from the light to the switch, our 12-2 hot or black is going to go to the common terminal on this switch. So just like over on this switch, our travelers are on the bronze screw, and we have our 12-2 hot or black on the bottom or on the common black screw. Now we'll move to the light. You'll see on the light we have a bronze screw, that's always our black or our hot, and our silver screw is always our white or our neutral. And in this case we have a plastic box so the ground doesn't need to be used, we can just roll the ground up in the box when we're done. I wouldn't cut it off because you may have a metal box in the future and it will need to be grounded so save it for later. There you go, black, bronze, white, silver. Let's close everything up, we'll get power turned back on and we'll check it out. Okay, power is back on. Let's check everything out, see if it works. Looks good to me. The nice thing about three ways is you can operate a set of lights or just one light from different locations, whether you're at the top of a staircase and at the bottom of a staircase, one end of the house to the other. Makes it convenient, it's nice. Helps out whenever you don't feel like walking across the house. So there you have it. You got any questions, you can feel free to leave them in the comments. I'll answer them for you. Any recommendations on a video, I appreciate some of those. I'd like to make some ones that y'all are looking for. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. More coming.